first design of three we're gonna make these days I'm using a negligee new gel polish and I'm applying a thin uh, coat of it make sure it's even and cure it then I'm applying extreme matte top coat so I can apply my design and it will not run anywhere I'm preparing my paper palette a brush wipe and I'm gonna use a stamping plate number three the floral design and I will take just a piece of that uh, flowers and using liner gel white I will just apply it where I need it now swiping off and using the brush wipe is very convenient for that my clear stamper I am cleaning on the lint roller and this way I extend the life of my clear stamper now I'm transferring the design and just take off the pieces that I don't need for my design. The design will be on the French area, so along the free edge of the nail. Now I'm checking where I place it, and very easy, just stamp. There you go. So I have the outlines for my flowers and cure them. Now I prepare. The colors that I will use so the gel polish base on top neon pink gel polish you can also use the neon pigments red color concentrate or you can use red nail polish uh, gel polish and yellow color concentrate or yellow gel polish also I take a little bit of the liner white and start with the fun using a design detail brush number three I will first mix a little bit of the pink polish and the clear after mixing always clean the brush so it's not getting um, overloaded with a uh, color. Then just fill out the flower area. And now I'm taking the color concentrate with a uh, clear or some darker gel polish. And the centers of the petals, I'm just showing the depth along the center of the flower not everywhere just in the center of each petal and just blend a little bit and it's easy when it's still wet and it's not cured and cure Now I take a little bit more of the concentrate mixed with the clear and put some shadow around the center flower. Now I mix yellow with the uh, neon pink. So I use neon pink in this color, uh, flower too, so they are connected together visually. And mix it again with clear and fill the center flower add a little bit more orange so it's a little bit brighter and of course you can pick the colors you like and I noticed that I uh, miss a little piece of um, stamp on the bottom but it's okay we'll just uh, leave it open and again every petal I just use a little dot and then blend it and clean the brush in between 
because when you blend it your brush gets dirty also with the um, previous color perfect and when you're happy with the result you just cure it and again I'm putting here the shadow just the same concentrate mixed with um, clear and now I'm just taking just yellow hue and fill the uh, small flower on the end and again using the concentrate so when you're using the all uh, the same concentrate in every flower the flowers look different but they match to each other they, they work together and cure actually on the client this design goes much faster than on a tip you can put a little rhinestone or some beads or something else in the center i'm just using the neon a drop of neon gel polish and make a shadow around the central flower and cure again so this design i made before i will show you in the end one more time so using katarina's brush this a tiny tiny brush i am now outlining the flowers with a white liner gel so each petal basically don't make straight lines make sure that the lines are kind of wavy curvy and very very light by the way don't don't forget to subscribe to my channel not to miss the second and third designs they will be also very uh, fun Sorry, they will be very, very fun designs. And now outline. Now I'm taking the detail on number three, clean it a little in a little bit of a polish, so it's not too dry. And I'll just blend the free edge just a tiny bit, just a tiny, tiny bit. Not the free edge, but the the outlines of the petals. And again, cure. And again, some concentrate. And just one more time, making the beautiful line. I took a little bit of the clear gel on the brush so the this line gets nicely blended. And again here and the center flower has a little petal on the background there i will just also add a little dot of red in there you know that's pretty much it i will add a couple more lines with the white you can leave it how it is or with the jessica brush you can just and focus Sorry, out of the focus. Some lines along the um, design flow. I'm talking more about design flow in my uh, art classes, in my life and online art classes. So just follow up on nadiabeauty.com. That's pretty much it. A very summary design. The white was too dominant, so I added a little bit more yellow and cured again. Completely curing and then uh, top coat, I prefer matte top. Just makes the design look very soft 
and summary, but you can of course use gloss. Uh, gloss. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you in my next videos.